Corner kicks are one of the most common set pieces a goalkeeper will face during the course of a game. If you want to better learn how to defend corner kicks and level up your game, join us as we go over the five steps to defending corner kicks. Let's go. Step one, communication. Survey the penalty area and ensure all attacking players are appropriately marked. Announce whether the corner will be swinging in or away from goal. This will help you and your defenders anticipate the trajectory of the ball. You can determine this by observing the kick taker setup. If they approach from behind the goal line, this indicates an in-swinger. And if they approach from the touch line, this indicates an out-swinger. Step 2. Positioning. After determining if the service will swing in or out, you will position yourself and a defender accordingly. For an outswinger, we can position ourselves more aggressively to increase our range to challenge the cross, setting up three to five yards off the goal line and one to two steps off center towards the back post. An open stance prepares the goalkeeper to move in any direction. Additionally, set up a defender a few yards in front of the near post inside the six yard box to deal with a low driven service. For in swinging balls, we set up more conservatively. To respect a whip ball to the near post, we will stay central between the posts two to three yards from the goal line, again utilizing the open stance. We will also place a defender on the near post to protect from the inswing. Their starting position should be square to the service, allowing them to break off to clear a low drive. Otherwise, they should retreat inside the post once they determine they cannot intercept the service. Steps 3 and 4 Decision Making and Communication The next two steps are presented together because they need to happen simultaneously. When the ball is served, the keeper needs to make the instantaneous decision whether to challenge the cross or not. When challenging for the ball, be loud and assertive so everyone on the pitch knows you are coming out. Punch or catch the ball as you feel fit. If you cannot challenge for the cross, retreat back to the goal line to prepare for a shot or header on goal, and shout away to give your defenders the right of way to clear the ball. It is important to get to the goal line to give yourself the most time to react to anything on target. Step 5. Distribute or clear your box. If you collect the cross, immediately get to the top of the box and look for a counter opportunity. Don't force a counter if it's not there, and wait for your team to regroup before distributing. If the ball is cleared by any other means, command your defense to get up and out of the penalty area quickly and resume open play. That's it for our tutorial, how do you prepare for corner kicks? Let us know in the comment section down below, and until next time, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on future content. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time here on Club Connection. Cheers.